another thursday another how you doing to my youtube fam hope you're having a wonderful week i wanted to talk today about something that i've talked about all week on my various social media platforms and it continues to kind of resonate with me and that is why change is so hard why creating something for yourself is so challenging why um, breaking out of, you know, your limiting beliefs, breaking away from the things that have kept you stuck for so long is so hard. And the reason that I kind of came across and is the thing that has just been, yes, 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 with me, is that it's hard because people don't believe in themselves. I um, am building a business that's based around transformation, right? It has a foundation in my own, me growing into the very best version of myself, whatever that looks like, you know, breaking out of my emotional eating rut, breaking away from some disordered eating, my beliefs about myself, my worth, my value, all of that forms the foundation of my business because if I'm gonna lead other people through those same things, I need to be walking my talk, right? So it's hard for me because I've had to cultivate self-belief and it's something that I have to choose every day. I don't just wake up and I'm like, oh my gosh, I nailed it, I've got self-belief and then it never <laughs> rears its head again. I have to choose to believe in myself every day. And belief, by the way, takes various forms and we'll talk about it in a second. But not only is that the foundation of me, that's hard enough it is, as it is showing up every day to do that, but then my business is based around helping other people transform and so battling with their own lack of self-belief. And so the reason why this stuff is so challenging, why I have clients that join me that get nothing out of their experience with me and I'm not you know, I, I'm not ego driven enough not to say that there are people that get given the exact same tools and resources and support from me as other people that do absolutely nothing with it. Whereas the people that do something with it, there's a whole lot of magic that's happening there. But the ones that don't, it's because they don't believe in their ability to actually follow through right? They don't believe that they can do the hard things. And then I mentor coaches to build their businesses where they have to show up, you know, authentically working through their own stuff, show up to do activities every day to build their business and connect with other humans that need their help. And the ones that don't do anything with that, that quit or just stay kind of mute and in this pit of inaction are the ones that don't believe in themselves and nobody like this is not about making anybody wrong but I want you to understand that the lack of belief in oneself is like a global epidemic I feel like and a lack of belief shows up as I don't have time um, I don't have the energy I don't feel like it today oh my gosh life is crazy right now my family need me um, all of these excuses that we allow ourselves to get caught up in, that's our lack of self-belief showing up in really sneaky ways. And I want you to think about for yourself, with whatever transformation it is that you're seeking, if you can look back on things that you've started in the past, things that you signed up for but never, never followed through on, things that you, I don't know, you took a course and you took all the notes, you have a notebook full of gems and gold on how to move forward and the notebook is still sitting on your desk or even is on a shelf somewhere and you've taken zero action. That's your la lack of self-belief showing up. But the thing that I want you to understand is that if you don't at some point do the hard stuff, break through that lack of belief. So feel the fear, but do the things anyway. Take action, even if it's messy. Go for it, even if you don't know whether it's gonna work, then you're, you're gonna be stuck in that forever. And it's gonna show up everywhere in your life. It's gonna show up with how you interact with your loved ones. It's gonna show up in endeavors that you wanna pursue in the future. It's gonna show up and stop you from truly living into what you want 
it, it's going to be there unless you decide that I'm going to push through and I'm going to do the hard work to, to get over this thing and to build my belief, build my confidence and truly have the capacity to believe that anything I want is possible for me. And that's where we've got to get to is just the capacity to believe that anything you want is possible for you. Because until you get there, of course, why would you do the hard things? Why would you show up and try and do the really hard things to break whatever it is, behavioral pattern that you've been in for so long, if you don't think it's gonna work anyway? I mean, duh, of course you're not gonna do that. If you fundamentally don't believe that it's gonna work or fundamentally believe that you will fail or that you're gonna quit down the line at some point, why would you show up and do the hard stuff today? Of course, it doesn't make sense. So you've got to foster this belief that my success is inevitable. That's what it boils down to. If I just keep showing up, if I just keep pushing through the heart, if I just keep seeking to be the best version of me, whatever that looks like, my success is inevitable because there is no way that you're going to plug away and do the things day after day and come out the other side with nothing to show for it. It just, it, it can't happen. Okay, so I want you to think about that for yourself. What are you procrastinating on? What are you not taking action on? What are you convincing yourself that you're waiting for the right time or you're waiting for the right moment or like someday, one day soon? What are you doing that to yourself with? And then break your pattern. Do something different. Make a different choice. Take the action. Jump in. Feel the fear. Do it anyway, because that's what it's going to take for you to reach your goals. Okay, I hope this was helpful. Again, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Consider subscribing to my channel if you want to get more of this. <laughs> Below is where you'll find me on my social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, um, even on my website. I would love for us to connect a little bit more. Come say hey. Um, yeah, I'm here for you. I believe in you. You just got to believe in you. <laughs>